We are here in Southern California. We are at the West Coast RC Raceway. Uh, we need all a little bit different type of review today. Today, I have my good buddy here, John Asher, and we are going to talk about the brand new Concept One All Wheel Drive Short Course Track Ready Proven uh, Race Truck for you. This thing is just boasting full of options here, and uh, pretty much we have a couple of trucks here ready to go for our race tonight. We are John Asher and I are racing in the Truck Series in the Four Wheel Drive Truck Class here tonight at West Coast RC Raceway. Dinner. Dinners. <laughs> we're beginners. We're just here to have some fun. Yes. And uh, you know, it's important for people to know about me, right? I'm not an <laughs> expert by any means. So I'm here to ask the questions you really want to know. Right? I like, guess so. When you say things like, this is boasting with options, why don't you tell me one of the options that the car has that you can let you know? This RC truck comes fully loaded with fully adjustable aluminum threaded shocks for a quick adjustment. You can actually just turn the threads on the actual collar and it will raise and lower the uh, spring tension on the foot. So it makes it really quick to work on and uh, just a really, really sturdy setup too as well. With that kind of stuff. You don't lose the little foot all over the place. Okay. How cool is this box? This is what's going to show up to your door, right? Yeah. So if I order this, this is what I get. This is awesome. Okay, so does this come with a radio in it? This actually comes with a 2.4 gigahertz radio in it and a uh, two, and a 4,000 milliamp, I believe, uh, lithium polymer pack also included. So this is your really true track ready, ready, ready to race out of the box setup. Check that out. That's cool. It's got cool warm faces. What's here? What's you can adjust? Yeah. You can see all cool the little adjustability. adjustments you can do there. That's pretty cool. It comes with the lithium polymer pack. Yeah, 4,000 million 25C. 25C, that's kind of an average. It's not an amazing battery, but it's okay. Yeah, it actually works out pretty well. But it's good if you get a battery with the car, right? Oh, what's this on the back? This is basically your netting. If you're running in heavy gravel or pebbles or any kind of dirt, that a lot of loose gravel, that's a lot of loose to keep it out of the main drive shafts and keep it out of the gear. So you want to keep that there and then you move it. But if you're running on the concrete and stuff like that, you can actually just take it off and move it off. So this is a 45 amp brushless ESC. And I actually forget what the KV of the brushless motor is. Just visit our website at manhobby.com and look at the Blitz RC Racer Concept 1. All the full specs are there. I thought, you know what, the race is starting to get going here. Just so y'all know out there, this is my buddy Dylan Asher. Make sure you tune in because John and I are fixing to do a lot of fun episodes together. Fun things you've probably never seen with RC. And we're just going to bring you a whole different level of having fun. And we'll see you on the track. Alright, guys. <laughs> tonight at West Coast RC Raceway where uh, we just finished up a really fun night of racing with the Blitz RC Works Concept 1. I'm here with GM John of uh, West Coast Raceway and what we're going to do here now is talk to John a little bit about what West Coast Raceway is all about, 
We, this is located in Southern California, so this is accessible to everybody, all the kids out there, and uh, everybody that's into RC cars. This is a great place to come and learn about RC cars and, uh, and basically drive. Uh, uh, John, tell us a little bit about RC, uh, uh, West Coast RC here. Well, West Coast RC has been around for about three years now. We hold some of the biggest events in the industry, yeah. especially for indoor. We hold the Reed e race. We just had the week-long Roar Nationals. You know, there's events that happen here, I'd probably say at least a good six to seven big events year-round that happen at this facility. And we've got everything you'd want. I mean, we've got pits, we've got power pits, yeah. screens everywhere, yeah. light yeah. everywhere, everything's <laughs> super easy to see, a hobby shop to stock, more and more could you want. Exactly. Well, let's take a walk that way and check out the uh, WCRC, the indoor track here. So here we are, we are at the West Coast RC, the indoor track layout. This is actually one of my favorite indoor tracks. And uh, John, tell us a little bit about the indoor track here. Well again, we put a lot of effort into our off-road program. As you can see, we have a 9,000 square foot indoor on-road track. We try our best to make sure that traction is always consistent. We're constantly cleaning the track. Again, full timing system, gliding over the track. And we have the ability to change the layout pretty quickly with the dot system we have laid out. And it's tied in the exact same picks that we use for the off-road program. That's awesome. If you take a look at the track surface, it's absolutely beautiful. Every time I come here, the track is like in perfect condition. And it's just a super fun track to, to run. Like, like John said, it's fully laid out. It's all digital, it's all electronic. So there's uh, all the lap counting is all you know, electronic and stuff. And real quick to show you right here, all the races, everything is broadcasted on here, what the lap times are and what the, uh, the driver's names, how fast they're turning, all that stuff. It's all digitally calibrated. John, can you tell us a little bit, are, are you guys still doing the, uh, at one time there was a, a live feed here, right? Well, we actually have a feed through Live RC. Live RC, that's so what it was. All of our practicing, all of our racing, every time we're racing, whether on-road or off-road, we are streaming live to the internet. So people from around the globe can see what's going on at our track at all Yeah, times. it's totally cool. Even during practicing, we've got live feeds on our on-road track and our off-road track. That's cool. So basically... When we're racing here, we'll pop something up on Facebook, and y'all can follow it on Live RC at, uh, at uh, WCRC here, and you can watch us actually race these races. Well, let's take a walk and take a look at the, I think they just ended the uh, race for the off-road course. Let's take a walk. So here we are at the off-road course here, and uh, I think it's short course stadium truck racing right now. We just, John Asher and I just finished our, our race, and uh, John, tell us a little bit about the off-road course here. Well, like we mentioned earlier with our off-road track, it's one of the premier off-road tracks that we find in the entire U.S. We change our layouts about, uh, about eight to ten times a year, so we're constantly striving for something new, something different. We're actually doing a new track layout uh, come Sunday night. You know, we come in, we completely till the dirt, clean it up. It's a fresh layout from the start. We don't cut a corner here and change something here. It's completely laid down on flat dirt and a brand new surface. An off-road track is approximately 6,000 square feet, so you know, obviously not as big as an off-road track, but it's still a lot of fun. Oh yeah, definitely. Like I said, this is one of my favorite tracks to come to. Actually, this is the only track I come to, and uh, I just really enjoy my time here. I know a lot of people, and every time we come here, it's always a ton of fun. Let's go ahead and take a look at the hobby shop here, and then while we're going that way, we'll check out the pit area. What do you guys have to offer the drivers in here? Well, as you can see from the walls in the shop, we pretty much have everything at Razor Cross we want. Yeah. Everything from fluids to parts for Associated, Losi, Durango, uh, Kyosho. I mean, a lot of the major brands, we sock the parts here. You know, chargers, tires, everything. I mean, we are a full service hobby shop, race shop. That's awesome. When I come in here, I just want one of everything. I just want one of everything, and that's pretty much all I can say about that. And there's a fully stocked snack bar with soda machine and everything. So we're always in and out of here talking uh, interacting with everybody that works here. Everybody gets along really, really well. And again, this is West Coast RC Raceway. This is what La Mirada, right? Yep. You, what's the website? Uh, WCRC.com is the website. Awesome. WCRCR.com. Cool. So here we are. A great, fun night racing at uh, WCRC here. My name is Pete. Thank you all always for checking out these re reviews. This is John. Thank you for your time and showing us around the race course. This is awesome. Come on out. Get yourself a car and have some fun. That's what it's all about. We'll see you next time.